who died in Dash, the ultimate crime, apart from the fact that you have CCTV cameras and ANPR cameras, and they're all on social media. So recently I've been reading about all of these articles about Dine and Dash families. So I think it's the ultimate crime. They go in, order loads of expensive food. The restaurant just goes, yeah, and that, that seems normal to us. Great, yeah, oh, more beer, more alcohol. Oh, yeah, no, that's fine. Then they suddenly Dine and Dash and they just suddenly go, oh, we've just been scammed. Now, I don't understand the guys that do the Dine and Dashing, right? They just basically don't realize that there's CCTV cameras everywhere. Not exactly the master criminals that they are. I mean, I hope they don't have a life of crime because they're going to be in prison in five minutes. And it's not just food, is it? This lady went for a whole Botox treatment, just like a puffed up face. Just goes, yeah, thanks for the injections. Oh, great. Yeah, I'm going to run before I pay. Oh, excellent. My puffed up face is all over social media. And now made it into front page headlines of a major newspaper. Yeah, I better go back and pay, I suppose. Now, I say that it's a young man's game because that's all I see on the recent reports of all these people dining and dashing. And now it's just basically, go. now it's become old people. So pensioners are now on the game. I mean, forget about their triple lock pension. Yes, ah, oh, this cost of living crisis. Yeah, I know. Let's all go to this restaurant and just do what the young kids do with their found. Yeah, okay, cool. Yeah, Clive, Janet, yeah, you after it? Yeah, okay, cool. But it's the fact that it's, it's the escape that they can't do. The actual getting away from the scene of the crime. So they're turning around. It'd probably take them 15 minutes just to get out of the chair. Feeling a bit tired. 10 minutes to put their coat on and probably another five minutes just to walk through the door. So all of that, the master criminals. I mean, the server must be incredibly terrible for her to basically not be around for 15 whole minutes. Maybe they're stressed, maybe they're overworked, maybe they're in the kitchen. But you know, just catch them red-handed by just staring at them like that. Are you serious? I'm sure the restaurant staff just let them go anyway because it's like, really? Really, you're gonna, you're gonna shuffle like this? Yeah, okay. Good luck with that. And obviously they're not on social media so they won't find out for a few weeks until someone just spots them in the street and goes, oh, are you that guy who did the Dine and Dash? And they just go, no, no, I didn't. And it looks exactly like you. No, well, it's someone else. Some other old person. Yes. <laughs>